my goodness. <laughs> Sounds like. I need a rolling pin so the first thing that we're gonna do is go to urban ore which is this really cool used place and they have so much stuff it's crazy and they oftentimes have a ton of kitchen stuff and they might have a rolling pin if not uh, I need to go grocery shopping after this and this grocery store we're gonna go to the big Berkeley Bowl they have kitchen stuff Perhaps they'll have a rolling pin, and if not, we'll go somewhere else. Alright, so here's the cool area. They have tons of knives. And then we're in the kitchen area. I was showing you this stuff, so they do have this little rolling pin, but I'm thinking I need like a, a regular size one. Is this big enough? I don't know. It almost, is this a toy? <laughs> is this a toy rolling pin? Like, I'm not even sure, but this is the only rolling pin that I've seen which is a little bit surprising because they have so much stuff like here's all the pots and the pans and we've got a bunch of lids here and then over here is a bunch of uh, appliances, various appliances, there's a little waffle maker and just tons of stuff. Um, here's some more appliances over here and some cutting boards down here and then here we've got a bunch of plates and cups so yeah this place is huge it's like a big warehouse and there's tons of stuff uh i only showed you a bit of the kitchen household supplies but it's like look at this whoa look at all this stuff here's like all the furniture and Here's some light fixtures. Um, they have lots of tables and stuff. I might just do a quick look around because I want to switch up my room pretty soon and I could use like a little, a much smaller desk than the one that I have. Um, so potentially they might have what I'm looking for here, but I'm not really feeling much like purchasing anything right at the moment because I'm not quite ready for it. <laughs> I still have to do everything that I'm going to do in my room and get rid of the desk that I already have. So I don't know. We'll see. But I did look around and nothing quite caught my eye of desk, what I'm needing. But is this? a kid rolling pin <laughs> um, and then I didn't get the rolling pin just because I feel like there's a better rolling pin out there for me and it might be the Berkeley Bowl <laughs> so let's go Alright, so first things first, I'm looking for the rolling pin. 
I'm in the household area and oh my goodness. Wow. So it looks like they have multiple options. I'm thinking this one would be plenty. It's their smallest one, but not like a toy one. Um, but they look pretty nice. You know what? I think I'm gonna hold off on the rolling pin. That's not the one for me. <laughs> I kind of want one of those just like wood, where it's just like solid wood one. Um, we'll see. The man who bagged my groceries was all, oh, nice haircut, because he was like so straight. I actually have a story about this haircut and how difficult it was to actually get it straight. These are my special squishy persimmons that are ready to go and I have to be really careful with them. The woman at the checkout was like, they have to be like that, right? Uh, super squishy, like super soft. So I was like, hey, be careful. These ones are really squishy. And I was like, yeah, they do. Like the other kind, the little, the little round ones, those can be hard, but those ones have to be really squishy or they leave like this weird, like film on your tongue. She's like, oh, I didn't know that. She, I was like, I was like, you should totally try them. Like they're really good. All right, so interestingly, in that massive store, they didn't have pumpkin pie spice. <laughs> and I think I wanna just make a little pumpkin oat cake for, uh, for Thanksgiving, just like a little one for John and me because he's gluten free and I don't eat refined flour or refined sugar so I can make a little one for us if we want or whoever else can have it as well but there's gonna be lots of other amazing desserts but that's what I'm thinking. But I wanted pumpkin pie spice because if I bought like all the spices it would be like really expensive. All right, I'm gonna go look for some pumpkin pie spice and I, um, maybe I'll go to Sprouts, see if they have it there. If not, I'll go to Whole Foods, see if they have it there. And if not, we're just gonna have a cinnamon cake. I'm in Sprouts. What do you think? They're gonna have it? Sprouts has failed me. What is going on? Oh my goodness, you guys. Look. <laughs> this is so adorable. I could have a freaking tree like in my room. That is so cute. I'm in Whole Foods. What do you think? They're gonna have it? Well, my friends, I'm happy to report Whole Foods did not fail me. I generally don't buy their spice brand spices anymore because I read something about some of their spices and it was kind of unfavorable. Um, there was like some testing done of like a bunch of different types of spices and compared them to each other and, and it was based on that. But yes, I have the pumpkin pie spice so I can make the thing. I want to go to Good Earth and actually stock up on, they have like really good bulk spices and if I was closer to them, I would have just got the individual spices and made my own pumpkin pie spice. Um, but probably next time I go get water at the spring, I'll go stock up with spices. All 
right, so the footage from this video was filmed previously to this moment that I'm in right now. As you can see, there is no more bruise. These are my lips. It's been like two weeks since I went and got the top lip, got the dissolver. And I just wanna say, I'm so glad I did. Oh my goodness, I feel so much better without like this big protruding hard like fake lip <laughs> yes definitely wonderful decision and um i'm not gonna go get them dissolved it just costs money and there's just no need so i'm not planning on ever getting lip injections again so i'm just gonna let these do their thing and then whatever um but thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Mwah, 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 mwah.